what I understand that. of the governor, who is a public official, he's an elected official. We should be able to ask questions. It's not about the questions, sir. So what is it about? It's about disrupting the press conference. No, we've nothing already, has been disrupted. We've already had somebody run around in here with a sign, call up QAnon, make fun of everyone, and call everyone names. Sir, I'm not going to do that. I've already nothing has been disrupted, sir. You haven't even started a news okay. conference. Yeah. Nothing has been disrupted. <laughs> You're, you're making you're questions. making provisions for something that has not even happened. Are you claiming that it will not happen? Sir, I'm telling you that you need to conduct your news conference and that the people are here to hold this governor I accountable. Sir. Yeah. Yeah. I do understand. Yeah. We're here I to hold the governor accountable. Yeah. 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 But there are proper ways to do it. What's the proper way, sir? To not to follow our First Amendment rights? Public expression, <laughs> sir, is critical. <laughs> to a functioning democracy. Arguing, this we governor are. has stood against our rights to protest and to assemble peaceably. It is wrong. Okay. There's a lawsuit against it already. Okay. And here you are attempting to stop the people from it's holding this attention. governor accountable. We are here to tell you that this governor is attempting to stop our rights to protest and to assemble. It is wrong. We will not stand for it. We are standing against it. We have a right, our First Amendment rights, we can express them peaceably. And that is, sir, what we are doing here. This governor is a is, this governor this governor is an enemy of the people. He's against what So is he an enemy or is he working for you? Sir, he is an enemy of the people and you too are an enemy of the people. Yes, sir, you are. You're attempting to stop us from gathering peaceably in a public building. Yeah. That, sir, is appalling and absurd. This is a public meeting. This is a public official. This is a public building. We have a right to be here, and we are not moving. We pay taxes. Yes. We're not moving. We're not now, where's the governor? Is he going to run and hide, or will he face the people? He needs to be yes. held accountable. We're waiting. Go get him. Yes. You're not back yet? Sir, I'm engaged. Go and get him. Right. Go and get him. We're waiting for him. You may have, you may have. We're waiting. Yes, we're waiting. We're waiting for the we're governor. Waiting. Sir. We're the people. You heard that before? We the people? Okay. Yeah, that's us. Okay. Your governor, by the way, throughout this pandemic, has been asleep at the wheel. Yes. And in recent weeks, during the upsurge of the variant, this governor has been mysteriously missing in action. We are suggesting to you, sir, and to the rest of the world, that when it comes down to the public welfare, this governor does not care. He doesn't care about that. When it comes down to the people's welfare, this governor does not care. He doesn't care. We are here to he make clear people. our position. It's time for him to address the people. Yes. Go and get him. Go get him. Face, face the people. Time to face the people. Yes. All I'm trying to do is uh, like any level. No, he's not the same thing. Sir, no, you're not talking to a child. I'm not. Okay. I'm not. Okay. okay. Let so me just tell you. Okay. Yeah. Let's have a press conference. Look, look. Is, is this, was, is this was, room ready Was the Boston us? Tea Party orderly? Thank you. I think you get my point. I, I understand what you're saying. Are Sir, you to where is the news conference? We're trying to hold our public officials accountable. Yes. I think that that is fair, I think that is reasonable, that we hold our elected officials accountable. You, sir, are attempting to stop the people from gathering in a public building on public property to address a public official. That, sir, is absurd. Go and get the governor. Go and get the governor. I'm through talking to you. Go and get the governor. If you're done talking to me, you can Go and get the governor. You make me leave. Make me leave. I'm disobeying. I'm not. I'm not. End of question. End of conversation. We're not moving. Go and get the governor. You're not back yet?
But I got a mask on. Well, yeah. Things work pretty good. The day I buy a fashion mask is uh, <laughs>
So, as the facilities manager for this property, yes, it is a state building, but it's not open to the public. Not every room in here. We conduct private visits in some areas, and I want to ask everyone who is not media to leave the room so we can conduct business. You can say what you need to say outside here. If not, I'm going to have you trespass on the property. Oh, really? Really? Now you're not turned into a trespass. We can't even talk to our governor. Isn't this a horrible situation? No, we cannot. But this is not the time to place that. But we want to ask a question. There's never seems to be a time to place for this. If he send it down and then he leaves. We want to talk to the governor. Okay, we so want to talk to the What about, is the private business going to be conducted? You said it's going to be private business. So what's the private business? Not private. We have... The press conference. Areas out here, for example, downstairs is. It's where a press conference, sir. So it's private, meaning that the public. This man uh, is going to talk about the health and well being right of this state. What the private business is. And we should be allowed to be here. Nothing private about public health, sir. So the public is visit. We've got an ongoing pandemic in, this, in, the, in the world. And this man comes down from Tallahassee but doesn't want the public to be in the press conference. What sense does that make? Sure. Is there, uh, my name does is Brady Brown with the governor's office. Can I have your name? I'm, I'm happy to help. Yeah, my name is Wells Cobb. Hi, Wells. It's nice yeah, to meet you. Yeah, and I'm going yeah. to take him down yeah. to Jacksonville. Okay. And I want to talk to the governor about okay. his policy regarding here. the pandemic, no, regarding critical race theory, okay. regarding House Bill 1, okay. regarding all of his policies. Okay that are negatively affecting the community. And SB 90. Sure. We well, we appreciate that sentiment. We appreciate that you guys wanted to be heard and you, you're voicing your opinions. Um, what I would like to do is if we can get something arranged, can I give you our business card so we can we have the conversation, please? We have to ask the governor to come to Jacksonville. Yeah, we will accept the business card. Sure. This is just the okay. communications office in here as well, ma'am. Thank okay. you. Let's get this started. We're here for a press conference. If we can get this sort of set and set back up, we're going to go ahead and take care of this separately if we could. But if you guys could get ready for the press conference, we would appreciate that. And let's just get some order backs into the situation. Please. What, what's the private, so what's the private business? I'm sorry. He said it was private business. What's the private business? That is we're going to start the press conference. That's what I need to do. So let's let's go ahead and get this. But we're going to get the cameras there, and we would like to get something arranged with you guys so we can have this conversation and make sure that it's constructive. So let's, sure, let's go ahead and do that. But we're, let's go ahead and get this back on to the press conference, please. We're, we'd like to get started, and as long as this goes on, we can get started. So can we, if we could do that, we would appreciate it. We're not saying you're trespassing. We're not being unkind to you. He said that. But we're at, actively, but I didn't say that. So let's have a conversation. Well, can let's you clarify what that means, ma'am? I'm sorry? There was a threat here. That we're going to be trespassed. Right. This, 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 this is the gentleman. Could you explain what he's talking about, please? Well, this yes, is the I'm Florida sure, Department yeah. of Law Enforcement, and if they've asked you to leave, then that's the case. That's what? Well, if he's with the Florida Department of Law Enforcement, no, he's I'm not. sorry, I'm, I'm just getting here. I'm the Department of Management. No, he's, yeah. not, the he's not with yeah. law enforcement. But if they've asked you to leave, if the facilities have asked you to leave, then I think that's the polite thing to do. But we're happy to interact with you guys, but they've Oops. asked yeah. you to leave. We, we appreciate that. But yeah. This is a public building, sure. and we don't okay. intend on moving. Sure. Okay. Thank you. Thank you for the conversation. But again, we'd like to start our press conference. Go ahead, so please. Do that please feel until free. Until you guys leave at the absolute Please, 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 please go ahead with your news conference. But we can't do that until we've asked you to leave. So why, why do you have to leave? Why do we have to leave? It's a public why, building. Why, because we're having a private press conference. A private press conference with a public we official. We don't allow the members of the public to come to the press conference. Excuse me, ma'am. Let me just get this straight. Yeah. You're having a private news conference with a public official. We don't allow members property. of the public to come to our press conferences. This is for members of the media with the elected officials. They have the conversation. We want to have a separate conversation that you guys want. To have but here's, here's my oh, question oh, oh, oh. to you. Here's my question. What about the press conferences what about? at schools where you've had the whole school there? And other places but where those, you've had we, people For security for reasons, him. we know who those people are. So there's a question we are. regarding security? There is Would you like my ID? So if we can move everyone out of the press conference, we're not moving. We're happy to have this conversation. We're not moving. This is a public 
building on public property with the public official. What about the voice of the people, Sir, young lady? I'm not screaming. I'm, not screaming. I'm speaking up just you're, as loudly as Patrick Henry did when he said, give me liberty or give me death. Ma'am, we're not moving. Hear me out. Nothing personal towards you, ma'am, okay? Nothing personal towards you. Towards the governor, yeah. We'd like to have a conversation with him, and we're happy to do that. Good, conversation. and we're ready to have Again, it. the press conferences are not open. We are ready to have that conversation. The press, and we'd like to talk to the governor. We are ready to have that conversation okay. with the governor. And what was your name? I didn't catch your My name. My name is Ben Frazier. I'm the founder and president of the Northside Coalition of Jacksonville, one of six plaintiffs been? suing your governor. Okay. Right, so, right, we want. so here's no, the deal. We're all representing the community that y'all have let suffer because you keep ignoring this pandemic, and that's really what's disrespectful. And I'm sorry that we're being disruptive or whatever, but it's been disruptive to our lives. The fact that we're here having to go to work, don't know if we're going to catch COVID, don't know if we have it, can't get tested, all the funds are drying up, there's no state facilities to get tested. That's disrespectful. That's why we're here. Like, it, this is the state of emergency. I don't want to be here at 9.30 in the morning at, at, at some press conference or whatever. But that's that's how important it is to us, and that's what we need you to realize. So when you say sure. you're trying to pacify us, and you're trying to say the governor's happy to speak with us, I don't really think he is. No. But now that the media is watching and everything, do you think that we could do have a think this is constructive to Yes, it is. Yes, yes, it is. Yes, 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 I don't think it's not. Yes. I mean, yes. I mean, again, again, we're happy to have this conversation, but I need Great. everyone it's to be able to We're not leaving. This is not an appropriate way to do this. Mr. Says who? Uh, says everyone. Says who? Everyone, 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 everyone is not agree with you. So I appreciate that that's your sentiment, yeah, but that's the same. What about the voice of the people? Again, we're happy to listen to you. We're the people. Be great, and let's have the news conference. Really, we'd like to be able to do that. Let's conduct it. Let's why not? Because this is the governor afraid to meet with the people? No, he's not afraid to meet with the people. Is the governor afraid to meet with the people? No, he's not afraid to meet with the people. We are his constituency. Is the governor afraid to meet with the people? No, we mean him no harm. No, we come in peace. But we don't know this that. is a peaceful well, man. Why don't you run our, our our licenses? I'm prepared to show you mine, and I'm sure everybody else here as well. Again, we're here for a we, we come so in peace. And I appreciate we that. We come in yes. peace. And you have my business card. Let's, right. Let's get connected all Okay. Time. The bottom and line is, yes. this is a peaceful. Yes. And no, no one's causing this any violence. It's nothing like that. We okay. So don't imply that. anything no, else. No, 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 okay. no. But there are still things that we But you've already so said that we're going to get trespassed. Because you are trespassing. Says who? Says this oh, gentleman. I do, how do you get trespassed on public? How do you get? Get? There we go. The governor's running. Look. The governor's running. When it comes down to public welfare, this governor does not care. When it comes to public welfare, this governor does not care. This governor does not care. When it comes down to public welfare, this governor does not care. Does not care. He does not want to meet with this public. He wants to run away. And tuck his tail between his legs. Why? He, he doesn't he, want he to. Really does he wants the to bottom line is, he does not want to deal with the people. What about, people. what about the voice of the people? What about the voice of the people? Got your car. Got your car. News conference. Where's the news conference? Where's the news conference going to be? Where's the news conference going to be? Where's the we're not leaving? You don't want the people to hear. We're not leaving. We're not Tell him he said, Welcome to Jacksonville and stop running and hiding. Tell him to stop running and hiding and meet with the people. Again, we're we're going to ask that we get this situated for a press conference in whatever capacity that we can. We can just conduct professional business, and we appreciate that you guys were able to come out. Um, we will work on getting this material reset as we are able. Again, you've been asked to leave. It's a secure facility. It's an FBLE building. We are citizens. We come in peace. But for law enforcement, we are peaceful citizens. For law enforcement, we are peaceful citizens, ma'am. So thank you. I, I, again, I appreciate the sentiment, but it's still a secure building, and both of those things can be true. So thank you.
we all ask this pledge of allegiance. We're, yes, are we're asking. That is we are asking everyone who is not so credentialed. This, this is a locked room. You cannot walk off the street, go up these stairs, and walk into this room. It stays locked. Correct. It's by appointment only. Okay. Correct. And Correct. we have had some people make an appointment today, and I allot this room for them. Okay. That's what this room was for. Got it. In which case, I asked we do again have to ask you to leave. And y'all did. Mr. President? Sir, you've been asked to leave, so I'm going to have to ask you to respectfully go ahead and leave out of the room if you'd like to conduct any business. Dr. Gerald, I'm not going to go ahead and take this room. I'm not the only person here. Sir, you all said you don't have any further questions. Guys, we're happy to take any questions. Thank you. 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 We're happy to have this conversation. Am I being arrested, sir? Am I being arrested, sir? And for what reason am I being detained? We're asking on a respectful. This is a member of the credential media. The governor is afraid to meet with the people. He is an enemy of the people. He is an enemy of the people. He is an enemy of the people. When it comes to public welfare, this governor does not care. When it comes to public welfare, this governor does not care. When it comes to public welfare, this governor does not care. This governor does not care. Why am I the only person being detained? We again are asking everyone that is a protester to protest. Thank you. 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 Thank you